Good evening, everyone. This is Henry Gamble with SimplerOptions.com, and in today's free video, I just wanted to share a couple ideas with you in Google. So, it pretty much goes without saying that the past two weeks have been extremely volatile. So, we had the initial big sell off right before monthly expiration, the continuation on that Monday, the massive snap back, and now we're kind of at this big indecision zone. This is an interesting place to me because from one perspective I try very hard to focus on trading with the trend and there's no arguing that Google is still in a bullish trend however the daily chart has clearly taken some damage so I really do think that in this type of environment the best thing that you can do for your trading is one maybe lower the number of positions you're taking so you don't have quite so many things on to manage and then just look for areas where you've got a decent IV percentile and you can start setting up range bound you know delta neutral theta positive type tile trades so I've been working this here in the September contracts I sold the iron condor that was short the $700 call and then short the $600 put with the concept being that if Google falls okay I've got the 50-day moving average along with a fire line right there at 630 that should be a decent area of support. If I rally up through 675, okay, well then that's my resistance there. If I get through it, I have to start making modifications. But the chart looks relatively sideways with decent implied volatility. And you can go out 18 days, sell that spread, actually get a decent credit for it, and then look to take it off in 9 or 10. Not necessarily all the way to expiration. Just kind of hold it to give yourself a place to participate while this market chops around. So... That's one idea that I've got there with Google. I think Facebook offers similar opportunities with that sideways trade. And one last chart, not quite as easy as far as the options are concerned, but I just noticed it because Ulta has been such a high flyer this year and throughout all of this move, essentially gave back everything that it made from March. So, you know, when you see that, it reminds you of why we are traders. We don't get married to positions. We flip at extensions. But then it also tells me if all that was given up, well now the chart is pretty much sideways and may give you an opportunity to you know, apply some more of those delta neutral strategies. So I hope that helps, gives you something to think about here over the course of the next 18 days into monthly expiration, and I will touch base with you on that idea at the next free video.